Smoking OG to keep me stay steady. I know the clip, I always stay ready. Had that boy puking like mama spaghetti. Annyeong. What's up, you two? It's your boy Gohan. And it's your girl, Rose, aka AC Twice, aka Chocolate Thunder, aka Seto. <laughs> Welcome back to our channel. If you guys are wondering what happened to uh, <laughs> Gohan's face, he was trying to shave and <laughs> ended up cutting off a huge chunk of his face. And so now. That's what we're left with. Sometimes it'd be like that. Yeah. Do you know what we're doing today? Um, tell me. We? Well, you actually. You're gonna be okay. reacting to things that girls do but won't admit. You guys actually requested this a long time ago, but the reason I didn't want to do it was because Gohan is actually, when he was in college, he was a uh, bio life science major. I feel like every time I bring up something, even though I think it's like gross or like things that like, I feel like you wouldn't know about the female body or the female anatomy, you're just like, it's natural. I didn't really think you were gonna have a strong reaction to it, but because people keep asking, we're just gonna do it, okay? Girls screenshot their fights and send it to their friends to form responses or like get reactions. Like, girls screenshot fights mm -hmm. with me, you screenshot yes. me, our text, and send it to your friend. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's not gross, but, but that's, hey, I don't do that to my friends. I honestly do this because like, we don't text fight anymore because we are like always together. But when we first started dating and we would have, you know, little arguments because like we were doing long distance and stuff, I would like screenshot things that you sent me that I thought were stupid <laughs> and like would send them to my friends and I'd be like, you believe this? <laughs> or I would just send them things to ask. Like it's for confirmation basically. So it's like, girl, tell me I'm right. Tell me I'm wrong. You can't tell me I'm wrong. And then like sometimes like they will tell you that they're you're wrong. Like you know what I mean? They'll be like, girl, you were kind of tripping in this situation. I have never like seen that. that. It's it's but most of the time they hype you up. They're like, yes, bitch, tell that. Yeah. Uh uh, no, he didn't, sis. Like you know, <laughs> so I'm like, you right. And then <laughs> they're like, trust your intuition. You're always right. He is cheating. <laughs> <laughs> well, I never it. cheated, but okay, I, okay, I, it's understandable. I, I see the picture. I see how yeah. it goes. You just want the confirmation. You want to be like, girl, tell me I'm wrong. Tell me I'm wrong. You can't tell me I'm wrong because I know I'm not wrong. But if you do tell me I'm wrong, then maybe I'll reflect on it a little bit. But I'm still not going to apologize because I feel like I'm not in the wrong. Like, it's like one of those situations. But actually, in our relationship, I'm never in the wrong. So you end up doing all that apologizing. There was this one day we were just chilling. We were having dinner or whatever. And um, we were talking about all the arguments that we've ever gotten to. And I was like, like, they, I was like, all the arguments we've ever gotten to, I was like, did you realize you've started every single one? And he was like, no, I haven't. And so I wrote down an entire list of 33 arguments that we've had. Okay, okay, you wrote a list between like three arguments. Two of the arguments, I came up with 33 that we had. Now, are you Just using thing. YouTube to vent out? <laughs> like... <sighs> okay. Girls stalk people on social media. Kind of figured, but like you don't even do social media like that. I do. I mean, you do do it, but like you you stalk other people. Yep. I thought you were like just like you just go in, see some messages, get out. Nope. So who do you stalk? I do stalk it. You stalk okay. me. So um no, I don't need to stalk you. I'm around you all the time. But like here, I'll tell you what kind of stalking I do because I'm a professional stalker. So like my friends, okay? Let's say they think like a dude on Instagram is like hot or whatever, right? or they want to find out more about this dude on Instagram or whatever. I'm like, all right, send me his username and then I'll be all up in the Instagram like, what do you mean send me his username? Hey. And I'd be like, I just be checking deeds. I just be like, okay, is he good enough for my best friend? Does he have a girlfriend? I go through all his followers. I go through all his hold posts, up, hold up. all his likes and make what sure that mean? he's good enough for my best friend. Oh, oh, okay. I thought you were, you were saying like as your best friend. I want to be friends with this guy even though. Oh no, 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 it's for my friends. Oh. And like, um, so this is really funny. I will tell you a random story. Um, and I don't really care if she's watching. His one of his ex-girlfriends is like a crazy psycho stalker. Uh -huh. <laughs> and like she made like an entire shrine Instagram dedicated to the memory of you and she would like steal pictures off of our So girls pick out outfits based on how hairy their legs are. Really? Wait, wait, let me ask you a question. So if you're like super hairy today, you don't wear shorts nope. or skirts, you nope. wear jeans. 
jeans or like long skirt. Anything that's just not so late. if you don't have any, you just say shaped it, then you're like, okay, I'm gonna wear some cute short stuff today. You want to show it off? Makes sense, but okay, <laughs> okay, okay. Oh, this is. Funny. <laughs> It hurts when we run without bras on. Wait, with, without the bra. Mm -hmm. So you don't have the bra and it hurts when you run? Mm -hmm. How does that work? Think about it. The only explanation would be if your boobs are too big and it, you run and it kind of like slap, slap, slaps your chest and you, you can't breathe. Well, it's not that you can't breathe, but it hurts, yeah. So what if you don't have a big boob? Does it hurt? I don't know. This is not gross, but I don't get it at all. Honestly, I, I don't get it. Why would it hurt? Because it's just lumps of like... Imagine having a lump of fat on your chest and you're jump, you're like moving, right? So it's like, <sighs> okay. Girls like to pluck guys' hair. Yes, you pluck all of my hair. Okay, okay, not the hair, but uh -huh. oh, 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 and the thing, um, there's some under my belly button. There's like li literally two strands. Yes, of hair. three, exactly three strands. Of yeah, hair. and she literally wants to pluck it up, but that that part hurts the most, like like your happy trail hair. Yeah, whatever that thing. And she plucks it. I'm like, okay, we up, we up, Why do you pluck my hair? Why? And she's like, I don't know. I'm like, Ugh. because I don't know <laughs> <What>? either. <laughs> Can I pluck your? You do. I do. I don't have happy trail hair, but you'll like pluck my armpit hairs too. No, I, you need to grow okay, some happy you, trail hair. Okay, you do my armpit hairs all the time. Yeah, but it's it's a guy thing. We don't do it like. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so this is like going along the same thing. We like to play with our armpit hair. You already knew that about me though, because you see me do it and you play with my hair too. Okay, so it's a girl's thing. Well, don't you play with yours? No. <laughs> Cause I, if I, you want me to be honest, I play, I play with your hair too. Yeah, but I don't play with my hair. I don't play with, like. Cause when you're just like sitting there, you know, you're doing like this kind of stuff, trying to be all sexy or whatever. You do that? No, you do. Oh, uh, I don't. I don't do this. Yes, you do. When I, you're laying down and then you have your phone and whatnot, trying to be cool. Babe, that's trying to be like kind of like a loud, trying to be okay, comfortable. Okay, and then I'm just like, I'm just like. <laughs> And I'm like, hey, why? But cause you don't have a lot of like hair on your body. Uh -huh. You're like a, you're like Rufus from Kim Possible. Don't know that person, but I the do. The naked mole rat. <laughs> but he doesn't don't have worry. any. <laughs> don't worry. He doesn't have any hair. Your body is hairless except for your armpits and another area, but let's not talk about that. Okay. <laughs> she exposed me out here. Stop! I'm not trying to. I'm just being honest. Okay, so when girls wash their hair, sometimes it gets stuck in their butt cheeks. What? It's how does it get into your butt cheeks in the first place? Well, if you want me to be honest, it's never happened to me, but it's just like it's a popular thing i'm actually very curious because i wonder how it does get stuck in your butt cheeks i don't think i've ever like felt anything in my cheeks enough to just want to like open them up and be like let me just do yeah so don't, don't, doesn't, doesn't it have to open up for it to go like in your butt cheeks no 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 because it, it's like thin so i'm guessing it can just like slide down but girls who actually get hair stuck in your butt cheeks let us know in the comment section okay, okay this is the one and only actually gross thing so far you think it's gross Cause like, look, I'm I'm imagining the butthole opening up, zoom, and then sliding in, like closing. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like put it in my butt. <laughs> <laughs> Next, we have period poops. You're pooping and periods coming out. What? I like. It's not gross that you do periods or like anything, but then poop periods. Isn't this kind of gross? Well, we can't control it. Really? You can't control it? No. It's not like people? No. Sometimes when you have like a uh, buildup of, you know, blood and stuff like that, when you have your period and you need to go poo, it'll come out in the same, like at the same time because when you're pushing, like for girls, especially like down there, just when you're pushing, sometimes it pushes out of both areas. So when you're on your period, you can get pee, poop, and blood. Perfecto. Most girls have period stains on a majority of their underwear. 
understandable. Okay, this one's not gross because okay, as as you know, I'm like a biology major or whatever. Your girls bleeding, girls having period is nothing weird at all. It's just our biological difference, so and it's natural that it would, you know, if you're not if you don't know when it's coming, it might be it might get on your pecky, so that's not weird at all. Okay. Um that's it for the video, right? Mm -hmm. So that's it for the video guys. Um it was fun knowing about these things that I didn't know. It's not gross honestly because like it's it's okay it's surprising i'm yeah. different yeah see yeah, because i didn't like expect you to react like this at all oh uh, it's really interesting yeah that's fun <laughs> so that's it for the video guys if you like this video and if you want to see more videos don't forget to like and subscribe also tune in next week for more videos Bye. You know I'm whipping that four. Yeah. Fresh out the bus, so I'm four. Yeah. My ninja's Haitian and they bust that chopper, so if you want smoke, you keep playing. A week ago, I went to Soho. I fuck your bitch in a dojo. <laughs>